been battling something called resistance. You may have noticed I haven't uploaded an official vlog in a couple of weeks and that is my first kind of slip up because I was uploading two videos a week. I have no excuse. I have to hold myself accountable for this. I was a victim of resistance. So I finished reading this book called The War of Art, not to be confused with The Art of War. So The War of Art is focused on writers and why writers have writer's block and they just don't want to write. But the book really applies to everybody who ever wanted to start something or do something or be someone, which is everybody in the world. Resistance is what keeps us from doing our work. Anyone who's ever started a workout regimen or has gone to school has experienced resistance. Resistance is what keeps us from becoming the people that we want to be, from doing the work that we are supposed to be doing. Stephen Pressfield says, the hard part is not the actual writing. The hard part is sitting down to write. Resistance is the force that loves immediate gratification. It wants the comfort right now because it feels safe right there. Resistance comes in a lot of forms. The most common of those forms is procrastination and I'm sure everybody is familiar with that. It's always easy to say, okay, well, I, I wanna do this, but I'm going to do it tomorrow or I'm going to do it next week. And we just keep pushing things further and further back just because we are scared to do it or there's just some weird force that keeps us from sitting down and doing our work. Sometimes resistance takes the form of external factors and it's easy for us to blame other things than ourselves for not doing our work. We blame our social life, our job, school. When you don't want to be doing something, you can find a million other ways to distract yourself. Facebook, Instagram, blogs, everything is a distraction from us doing the work that we are supposed to be doing. Staying comfortable and watching Netflix all night. That's resistance. Netflix is resistance. You can find a million excuses for not doing your work, but at the end of the day, the only way you are going to improve yourself, hone your craft, and grow is to work. It's, it's just to work on it. When we are trying to grow and progress to the next level and create and be productive, resistance is the force that keeps us from doing that. Resistance loves comfort and resistance is fueled by fear. And it's up to us to beat resistance. It's up to us to fight the war. And it's a new battle every day. You have to wake up and be aware of resistance and the distractions and the excuses that you're making for yourself. Learn to face them, learn to beat them. It's not easy, but it's learning to be miserable and it's learning to delay gratification because you know that once you get your work done, it leads to success and it leads to you growing as a better person. You can decide to start working on whatever it is you wanna be working on or you could just get back in that zone, in that flow where you are working hard and concentrating and just losing yourself in the work. The goal every day is to just sit down and beat resistance. As long as you sit down and deliver your part, then you have done what you need to do for the day. Regardless of the quality of your work, whether you like it or not, that's not the point. The point is to sit down and be productive, to make something. Beat resistance for the day, sit down and work. Do your thing. So all the power to you guys. I hope that you are winning the battle in your life against resistance thanks guys for watching i will see you again very soon and if i don't then you better get mad at me and tell me to beat resistance and make more vlogs more frequently and stuff okay bye